This is it. This is my review of Visible. Visible is a new carrier by Verizon offering unlimited talk, text, and data for just $40 a month. What's also great is on June 26th, Visible announced they're no longer gonna have a data speed cap. That means they're now offering full speed LTE data with coverage on the Verizon network for just $40 a month. This is one of the best deals in wireless and current customers and new customers who sign up right now are gonna get locked in to that unlimited high speed data allotment. Which begs the question, is Visible worth signing up for? How is the service? And how can they be so affordable? In this video, I'm talking about everything you need to know about Visible and what my experience has been like using their network. Visible first launched in 2018 as an invite-only carrier exclusively for iPhones. Since then, they have opened up the plan to the general public, you no longer need an invite code, and they offer support for a wider selection of phones. If you have a supported device, the way you sign up for Visible is through their mobile application. In fact, everything you do with Visible is through their application. You sign up for the service, order a SIM card, pay for your plan, manage your account, and get support. You can even purchase a new phone. And this app plays a huge role in how Visible is able to offer such affordable service. You see, Visible is an online-only carrier. They have no physical store locations. As a result, they save a lot of money on expenses that are associated with having physical stores. This includes leasing building space, staffing sales employees, paying for heating, electricity, and all of that. Visible is able to pass on these savings to their customers in the form of a super affordable plan. Being owned directly by Verizon also means Visible doesn't have to pay to get access to Verizon's network. This again allows them to have one of the best prices for unlimited data. What's especially great about Visible's price is all taxes and fees are included, so it is just $40 flat. And this compares extremely well with other offerings. US Mobile used to offer the cheapest unlimited plan at $40, but that plan has data speeds maxed at one megabit per second. Again, Visible is now uncapped, so you can literally get over 100 times these speeds. A comparable plan from US Mobile is $55 a month, so Visible really is one of the most affordable options for unlimited LTE data on the Verizon network. In fact, I'd go as far as to say Visible currently offers the best unlimited plan on the Verizon network in terms of price to performance. So what is the experience like using Visible? Visible was kind enough to send out two free months of service, and I've been testing them out on my Pixel 3a, and I wanna provide you with the most helpful information possible. And it turns out my experience has been different from what other people have been experiencing. So I'm gonna leave links to their stories and experiences in the video description so you can check those out. It turns out achieving $40 a month for Unlimited does require a few compromises. Now, as you would expect, the basics of talk, text, and data all worked fine on Visible. This is, after all, a company owned by Verizon but each of these had their own caveats. Calls, for example, worked as you'd expect, but Wi-Fi calling was only supported on iPhone, not on Android. Visual voicemail was also hit or miss. On my Android device, it worked perfectly fine. I have read some reports of it not working. To fix this, you wanna take the SIM card out of your Android phone, pop it into an iPhone if you have one available, set up visual voicemail there, and then pop the SIM card back into your Android phone and you should be good to go. All forms of messaging work totally fine for me, so nothing to really talk about here. And cellular data. Okay, here is where we have so many different things going on. Let's dive into this. Yes, Visible now offers full speed LTE data, but full speed doesn't always mean highest quality or highest priority. Visible is using what they describe as quote, optimization technologies to transmit data files in a more efficient manner to allow available network capacity to benefit our members. Visible has more details on this on their website. They also promote getting about five to 12 megabits per second down and two to five megabits per second up on average with video streaming at 480p. What's amazing about Visible is your data speeds will never be slowed based on how much you use. So you can use 300 gigs in a month and still get the same data speeds on Visible. However, 
your data speeds will be impacted depending on network congestion. And this is where data priority level comes into play. So let's take a moment to break this down. Basically, with all carriers on all networks, when you have multiple phones trying to access one tower, that tower can only transmit a certain amount of data at a time, and it has to choose which connections to prioritize. This is a lot like driving on the highway and running into traffic. If everyone has the same priority level, you all slow down to the same speed. However, if some people are prioritized over others, it's like a separate lane is getting built on the highway that only a few people can travel on and they can go a lot faster. So with data deprioritization, your speeds may slow significantly during times of network congestion. In fact, I was able to observe this myself by running a speed test. You can see I have Verizon's above unlimited plan on the left and visible on the right. When I ran the tests individually, both speeds were about the same. However, when I ran the speed tests at the same time, Visible had a noticeable drop in performance. Now, 10 megabits per second is still plenty fast to get everything you need done on your phone, but your experience could vary depending on your location and network congestion. If you live in more rural areas with fewer people and fewer devices, then you're probably not gonna notice a difference. If you live in a city with more crowded and populated and everyone's trying to use the network at the same time, then your speeds could slow significantly. Some users online have reported the speeds dropping to unusable levels. Again, network performance is extremely dependent on your location. See if you can find someone who's tried visible in your area or consider signing up for a month to test them out before committing. I also wanna highlight visible does support the hotspot feature they say limited to one device. I was able to have three devices connected and working properly at the same time, so I don't know what's up with that, but you do get unlimited high-speed LTE hotspot data with Visible. That's amazing, love to see that. The last thing I wanna talk about is the activation process. For me, activating a new line, my process went very smoothly. There was one hiccup where I had my location not being entered correctly in the app, I was able to fix this by restarting the application. However, for other users, it seems to be very hit or miss. One Reddit user says, quote, I've activated five lines since launch and two out of five were disasters. The others were perfect. There's either a great experience with Visible or a total failure, no in between. Links down below to check out this story and others. Basically, what I think was happening was this. Visible's announcement of their uncapped data speeds drove a surge of people to sign up for their service. Their systems weren't ready for this kind of volume of traffic, and as a result, more people than expected were experiencing problems with their activation. When they went to reach out to Visible support, that was getting mobbed by additional traffic, and response times took longer than expected. So for some individuals, their activation process was less than ideal. However, again, for others, They've reported a super smooth experience, so it can be hit or miss. The two tips I have for getting the smoothest activation on Visible are one, verify your account number and PIN with your current carrier if you plan to bring your phone number over to Visible, and two, purchase your phone directly from the manufacturer, make sure it's unlocked and ready to go on Visible's network. You may also consider purchasing an unlocked phone on Swappa, they have really great deals on used electronics, so you can consider checking them out. Hopefully those tips help you have a smooth activation process on Visible. They're a young carrier, they're using new technology, and they're evolving rapidly. I'm excited to see them grow, but of course there may be a few hiccups along the journey. What I love to see from Visible is how active they are on social media, especially on Reddit. They engage with the community, they answer questions, they talk about new features they're working on, and they acknowledge problems and so much more. That's really cool for me to see and I love that. No other carrier would really do this, especially not someone like Verizon, so I love it. And ultimately, as Visible is a young carrier, I think one of the best ways to experience their network is to consider using Google Voice. What Google Voice is, is an online service that gives you a real phone number and lets you make calls and send texts over Wi-Fi. You can also port your number to Google Voice and it will act as a safe haven. You can sign up for any plan on any carrier, your number will be completely safe in Google Voice and you have nothing to worry about. So you can then sign up for a new plan from Visible, activate on a new number, 
My activation process went super smoothly and you should be all set and ready to enjoy unlimited Verizon data for just $40 a month. Visible may not be for everyone, but they are definitely one of the best deals in wireless right now, especially if you're looking for unlimited LTE data on the Verizon network. They have a $20 referral program right now. You can sign up using my link in the video description and you'll enjoy $20 of account credit. Like this video if you found it helpful, share it with one person curious to learn more about Visible, comment down below if you have questions. I'm Stetson, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.